Our final topic with percents is percent measure. We learned about percent measure in our pre-lecture video. So when we look at this problem, we're dealing with an IV fluid. We're told that there are a thousand milliliters of D5 1 half and S. So the first thing we have to remember from our pre-lecture notes is what these things stand for. So there's actually two things going on. There's D5 and then there's half NS. So D5 literally means that we have 5% dextrose. Dextrose is a sugar and so 5% would be 5 over 100 and we're setting that equal to an unknown amount of sugar in the full 1000. Now we do want to pay attention to our labels and in our pre-lecture notes we learned that sugar is a solid and so that's measured in grams by weight and we're dissolving it in water to make an IV fluid so that's measured in milliliters and that's part of why I'm putting my thousand on the bottom because it is also milliliters. So again solving with a cross product 100x is equal to 5000. Divide both sides by 100 and we get x is equal to 50 grams of the dextrose. So the second half of our problem is to figure out the sodium chloride. So we're dealing with the half normal saline. Now we have to remember that this half is not 50 percent but it's half of normal saline and so normal saline is at 0.9 so half normal saline is at 0.45 percent salt. And so we'll take that 0.45 and we'll make that into a fraction. Now this fraction feels a little strange because it has a decimal right in the fraction. So we don't move the decimal at all. We just take it straight down into the fraction 0.45 over 100. And again, salt is a solid measured by weight, grams. We're dissolving it in water to get an IV fluid. So we have milliliters in the denominator. We want to know how much salt will there be in our 1000 ml IV. So solve with cross product 100 X is equal to and multiply on this diagonal as well and our calculator gives us 450. Divide both sides by 100 and we get 4.5 grams of sodium chloride. So in this particular IV there are 50 grams of dextrose, that's the sugar. There are 4.5 grams of salt, that's that half normal saline, and there would be 1000 mls of water because with our IV fluids, and you have this in your notes, we expect these to dissolve and so we're going to use the full amount of water.